ROPE stands for Repetitive Optical Performance Enhancement System. Basically, it's designed to help you meet your own challenges. Your own challenges can be any challenges. It's a challenge by choice philosophy. The challenge by choice means simply that you need to come outside of your comfort zone. The only failure you can have is to go to a certain point, stop, and not take the other step. If you go five steps up that ladder and you stop and you say, I can't go any higher, you know, I just can't do any more. What are you supposed to do? Take another step. Take another step. One more step. If you do that, you have been successful. The, the saying we use here is straight as an arrow, light as a feather. Straight as an arrow, light as a feather. The faller needs to be straight as an arrow, light as a feather. I need to have my chin, my chin, my chin touch, touching my knuckles. And when I fall, I have certain commands that I have to do. I want to make sure he's back there to catch me. Spotter ready? All right, ready. Falling. Fall on. Spotter ready? Spotter ready? Ready. Falling. Falling. Very good. The higher you go, the safer you are in a ropes course. Most of our accidents will happen five feet or less off the ground. Straight as an arrow, light as a feather. Straight as an arrow, light as a feather. The faller needs to be straight as an arrow, light as a feather. Spotters ready? Ready! Falling! Fall on! Perfect. Oh, now walk him backwards this way toward me. Oh, this way? So shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Now people with the feet, let the feet down. People with the head, neck, and shoulders, raise him up. Perfect. Good job. <laughs> what we have is you'll be sitting in a sit harness. You'll be going up a rope. The rope is stretches a little bit. It has about an eight to ten percent stretch. When you fall, it keeps you from snapping on it and hurting yourself. It kind of gives a little. The cable gives a little. So at five feet, if you fall off the ladder, there's a good chance you'll touch the ground. You won't touch it hard because either myself or well, I'll be on belay which means I will break you off and you'll kind of hit the ground about like that. So honestly, after you get past that five foot, I break you off, this stretches, the rope stretches, the rope stretches, and you stop before you touch the ground.
play hard, play fair, play safe. So, in your own words, what would it mean to play hard? I've already heard some people talk about that when they did the pink hunt. 